Hey guys, Allison here with Tor from Live Sail Die. We're here at the Predict Win Girls Champs at Koei Yacht Club. It's a beautiful day. The ladies are all out on the beach ready to go. We're so excited to be here. We're just going to go talk to Stella from Predict Wind about the weather. Hey Stella. Hello, how are you? Good, thank you. How are you? I'm great. Are you excited for today? Yeah, it should be really nice. Yeah, what's the weather looking like? So we've got a southeasterly breeze of eight knots, decreasing to five knots, going a little bit easterly. So it should be good. Pretty sunny. Yeah. Be a beautiful day to be out on the water. <laughs> yeah, definitely. What, and what are you racing in today, Stella? I'm racing the 29er. Yeah. Cool. And who, are you crew or helm? I'm helming the boat, yep. And who's your crew? Um, Becky, yeah. Cool. Hi everyone. Well, um, I'd just like to welcome everyone here to um, Koa Yacht Club. My name's Andy um, Commodore here and I'm really excited to have um, such a cool turnout today. We've got over 120 sailors, which is just fantastic. We're really excited. We're here with an Opti sailor. Can you tell us what you're sailing today, who you are and what club you're representing? Um, I'm representing Rolak Rana. I'm 10 and I'm sailing an Opti. And what's your name? Rebecca. Rebecca, so what is your goal for the day, Rebecca? Um, getting my starts good. Awesome, and how much training have you done for this regatta? Um, I do training every Friday, so like quite a lot, but yeah. Awesome, well good luck to you. Have fun out there. We're here with Liv Mackay from Yachting New Zealand. Liv, tell us a little bit about your journey and what you're up to now. Yeah, so I uh, did similar to what's going on here today. I grew up uh, doing Opti, then the classic P, Starling, 420 kind of journey. Where has that journey taken you? So you ha were here basically as a kid sailing through the Opti's. What would you say to the girl sailing now and where has that gotten you? I'd say like with my journey, I basically just had a really good group of friends when I was younger and so for me that was a massive part of why I keep going but for sure once I finished Opti that kind of dropped off and I just really enjoyed the competition side of thing and really grateful that I just kept going and now I'm lucky enough to get um, a part of this New Zealand Sail GP team which is awesome and sailing NACA 17, learning lots of other different types of foiling boats and loving it. Yeah, it's a great opportunity for the girls to look up to you and see that. So congratulations on the things that you're doing at the moment. It's awesome to have you here. You girls look like you're doing good at uh, that first beat. How was how was the race for you? Um, yeah, it was pretty good. There was a bit of a skew in the race course, so it was just like a one tack beat for us. But taking it out left into that really good pressure was the right call. And yeah, we could get into that before the rest of the fleet and make good gains on that short tack. So yeah, it looked pretty light at the start, but then the pressure filled in for you. How did, how did you do in the end? Um, yeah, we could see the. A uh, big pressure line coming down the left side, so we just decided to start pin and take it on into that. And yeah, we maintained to, we kept on the left side for the whole race, so ended up winning that one, which was good. Awesome, well done. So we've just been watching the Opti fleet and we've grabbed one to have a chat to. What's your name? I'm Lucy. Lucy, how's your racing been today? Um, pretty good. Improved a lot. Yeah. Yeah. How many races have you had? Um, three. Oh, that's really cool. So, how do you think you did? Um, I did really well. I was kind of mid from two of them, and then the third I came about fourth. Oh my goodness, amazing! Is this your first regatta? Um, no, this is my third. Your third, and what made you get into sailing? 
Um, well, my sister did sailing, Sophie, she's Miss Starling now. And I just, I just watched her do regattas and I was on a rib. And I just really kind of wanted to get out there and do the same thing, kind of, yeah. Cool, and what, what's your dream? Um, probably to sail one of the America's Cup boats one day, maybe. Oh, amazing. Just get on it and just see it. Mm, oh, you could, cool. you, could, you could race in the America's Cup. Yeah. Well, you never know. How old are you now? I'm 11. Well, we might see you there in a few years. Well, it's been a great day on the water. A little bit tricky conditions for the girls, but um, you know, it's so good to see them all together, teamwork and everything between the different yacht clubs. So it was fantastic out here today. Yeah, we've had everything from um, the 29ers all the way down to the Opties, from little kids up, up to the older ones. It's so great to see so many of them out on the water. I think 120 kids. 120 kids, yeah. Pretty amazing. So I think we're starting to wrap up. There's only, they're just finish, finishing off the last race. It's been an awesome day. I think there's some America's Cup talent out here today. For sure. <laughs> yeah, can't wait for the next girls regatta. They've really just shown us that um, they're competitive and they're wanting more, so it's awesome to see.